Hey folks, before we get into it, just wanted to let you know that today's episode is brought to you by none other than Raid Shadow Legends! Raid Shadow Legends is the premier collection battle RPG available for free on your mobile device of choice. With over 300 upgradable champions to choose from and more being added, there's never been a better time to jump in, especially since new players receive 200k silver, an XP booster, an energy refill, and an ancient shard to help them get going. Download Raid Shadow Legends for free today and start having fun. And I'll see you in the game. And now, on with the video. <laughs> Folks, being an artist isn't easy. I've often struggled with understanding how to be an artist. I used to think it meant challenging society's cultural taboos, forcing people out of their comfort zone by being some kind of transgressive, irreverent shock jock. I now look back at this period of my artistic journey and feel ashamed, because I realize how immature and tasteless it was. Every artist has a platform with which to speak to the public, and because of which I now understand that every artist has a moral obligation to use that platform to enact positive social change. And finally, that brings us to the topic of today's video. Fascism. Fascism is on the rise, and I'm morally obligated to use my platform to try to raise awareness. But what is fascism? Well, I wish that question had a simple answer, but in our current climate, fascism can actually refer to one of eight or nine different things, each of them equally real, each of them equally dangerous, and each of them equally on the rise. So, let's go down the list. Fascism definition number one. <laughs> I just drank a whole glass of cum! <laughs> what? I SAID I JUST DRANK A WHOLE GLASS OF CUM! Yeah, I heard you, goofball. I'm sure you didn't just drink a glass of cum. It was probably a glass of milk. Oh, it was cum all right. Folks, what my idiotic roommate is doing is obviously some kind of riff on the fact that there's no visual difference between a cartoon ghost drinking a glass of milk and a cartoon ghost drinking a glass of cum. It was cum! But don't worry, because I'm sure what he actually drank was just a glass of milk. Not milk! Cum! What the f- What the heck is wrong with you? Goofball, you wanna know how I know you didn't just drink a glass of cum? Because this is a YouTube video, and you can't drink a glass of cum on YouTube. Says who? Well, the terms of service. The YouTube terms of service say you're not allowed to drink a glass of cum? Well, maybe not in so many words, but effectively, yes. You can't drink a glass of cum on YouTube. Huh. Well, that's weird. Because I just did. You didn't! You didn't just drink a glass of cum! You're lying! Tell them you're a liar! You know, I've had it with this puritanical website and its sanctimonious censorship. I say let the ghosts drink cum! This isn't the time for this, goofball. Especially not while Mr. Shadow Legend is watching. You never think it's the time for the things I care about. <laughs> like drinking glasses of cum. <laughs> Where would you even get a glass of cum? Oh, a lady never reveals her secrets. <laughs> I'm not entertaining the notion that you just drank a glass of cum, goofball. It was a glass of milk. And I'm not interested in this kind of immature, tasteless humor. Oh, it has a taste all right. Very salty. Kind of like pennies or seawater. <laughs> Where are you going? I know you have very little respect for Brain Dump Goofball, but not even you would do something as disgusting and inconsiderate as to drink an eight ounce glass of semen while I'm trying to be responsible and use my platform to have a serious conversation about fascism. And I can demonstrably prove it. <laughs> you didn't drink a glass of cum, goofball. I can prove it. DEMONSTRABLY! What the hell is demonstrably? <gasps> oh! 
Demonstrably. Well, why didn't you just say so? Goofball as luck would have it, I went to the grocery store yesterday. And as I often do on my trips to the grocery store, as is my want, I bought a half gallon of 2% milk. And I would wager dollars to donuts that if I were to open this refrigerator, reach inside, and pull out that milk, there would be a quantity of milk missing from that half gallon, precisely equivalent to the eight ounce glass from which you just drank. Well, that milk's not even open. Look, it still has the thing on it. See? Please tell me you didn't just drink a glass of cum goofball, please! Well, what's the big deal? You said yourself, there's no visual difference between drinking a glass of milk and drinking a glass of cum! You can't drink a glass of cum on YouTube! This whole video's gonna get demonetized! Or even worse, it'll get taken down! I won't get any ad revenue! All the time I've spent working on it will have been wasted! <gasps> Mr. Shadow Legend. If Mr. Shadow Legend sees this video, he's gonna ask for his money back, and I've already spent it. Okay, calm down, big guy. Jeez, you act like you never seen a cartoon ghost drink a glass of cum before. Nobody's seen that before. Oh, and not to mention all the subscribers I'm gonna lose. Oh yeah, brain dump. I used to like it until I got to the episode where the cartoon ghost drinks a glass of cum. I kind of fell out of it after that. Spit it out. Goofball, spin it out! Where is it? Where is it? Where's the cum? Where's the cum? <coughs> Buddy, you need to calm down! Jeez, is this an entire chicken? For fuck's sake, Goofball, do you even chew your food? I don't got time to chew, I got bitches to fuck and cum to drink! Well, it looks like that glass of cum has been entirely dissipated into your putrid ectoplasm. <laughs> Is it just me, or does the phrase glass of cum get funnier the more you say it? This isn't funny, goofball. I'm trying to do something responsible with my platform. Don't you care about the rise of fascism? Uh, I guess, but... Uh, frankly, I'm more concerned about the rise of Marxism. Don't shoot the messenger! Hey! It's not okay to throw things! Who the hell is that? Ooh, it's that tennis instructor from down the hall you have a crush on. Christine? She's here now? I can't let her see this. You have to talk to her, goofball, but don't let her in. Hi, hi, Captain. Hello. <laughs> Hey Goofball, me and the girls are having a little party this Saturday night, so we thought we'd check to see if maybe you and Max wanted to stop by. Who the hell is Max? <gasps> oh! You mean the creep. Well, why didn't you just say so? Ah, uh, yeah, I don't think he's gonna be able to give you an answer right now. He's wrist deep in my vomit looking for cum. Uh, I'm sorry. What? I said he's wrist deep in my vomit looking for cum! What the fuck is that? Eh, don't worry about that. That's just the Raid Shadow Legends logo. Oh, what now? Yeah, what do you want? Hello, calling from the office of Ray Shadow Legend. He was hoping to have a quick word with the Mr. Max Galati. Is he available to speak? What? Mr. Shadow Legend is calling now? Great, patching you through. Wait, no! Hello, Mr. Galati. I take it this afternoon is treating you well? Oh, uh, m -m 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 Mr. Shadow Legend. Uh, to what do I owe the honor? I'm just checking in on how my video on the eight or nine forms of fascism is coming along. I'm sure you can understand how I want the content I sponsor to be only of the utmost quality. Don't you, Mr. Galati? Uh, actually, it's... Jillardy, 
but as luck would have it, you caught me right in the middle of making the fascism video. Oh, good. Remember, you have to go over all eight or nine fascisms. And I'm certain you also haven't forgotten the conditions stipulated in our contract. To keep the Raid Shadow Legends logo on screen, we're gonna need that logo up for the entirety of the video, if that wasn't clear. Yeah, about that. Would you be mad if I were to have accidentally gotten the Raid Shadow Legends logo covered in cum vomit? What? I said I got the Raid Shadow Legends logo covered in cum vomit. I'm sure you're aware, Mr. Gallardi, that I just so happen to own the bank that owns your apartment building. Yes, Mr. Shadow Legend. And that same bank also owns the properties that are occupied by pretty much your entire extended family. Yes, Mr. Shadow Legend. I can hurt you, Mr. Gallardi, and I can hurt the people you care about. You don't want to have to force my hand. You don't want to disappoint me. And you certainly don't want to upset me. Isn't that right, Mr. Gallardi? It's Gillardi, but... Uh, it, it, listen, if you'll please just let me explain how the... But I don't need to threaten you. Because when you say things like... I got your logo covered in cum vomit, whatever that means. I know you're just joking. It's just some of your irreverent shock jock humor. Not humor that I appreciate, mind you, but just a joke. <laughs> and I'm sure your video on fascism will be very educational. Mr. Shadow Legend, I gotta be honest with you. I don't even know what fascism is. <laughs> Nobody does. Make the video, Mr. Gallardi. Don't disappoint me. It's Gillardi. Ooh, mama. <laughs> hey, you know how some ghosts are green? Like, there are green ghosts sometimes? Well, don't tell anybody I said this, because they'd call me racist. But the green ghosts are freaks. All of them. Total freaks. Like, every green ghost that I've ever met has just been... A complete whore! I mean, I know you don't care about any of this. You're probably not into ghosts. You're not into ghosts, are you? Because if you are, I could hook you up with some. I'll never be an artist. Trying to enact positive social change. I'm completely out of my depth. I'm just some dumb, bald Italian guy. I mean, what would a bald Italian guy know about fascism? Mm. All I ever wanted was to make a living doing what I love. But it's just impossible. It can't be done. It's impossible. Oh, I'm sorry, mm. buddy. And if only there was somebody to blame. Oh, wait, there is. It's you. It's you, Goofball. The one working against me. The saboteur. It's you, Goofball. It's always been you! Because no matter how hard I work, 
no matter how many times I try, you're always there! With a box of fake cereal, or a ventriloquist dummy, or a, a, a fucking glass of cum! It was milk! What? <laughs> it was milk! I was just messing with you, you psycho! It was milk? You promise? Yes! You swear? Yes, I swear! It was just a glass of milk. <laughs> yeah, all right. No, no, I get it. You do what you gotta do. All right, thanks anyway. Goodbye. That was Mr. Shadow Legend's secretary. They're dropping us as a sponsored partner. She also said Mr. Shadow Legend wants us to know that we've made a very powerful enemy and offered no explanation. Well, how are we gonna make money now? I guess we'll just have to rely on the generosity of our other sponsors. Like the fine folks at NordVPN! The internet can be dangerous, but you don't need to compromise your family's safety. Reclaim your online privacy today with NordVPN. Right now, you can get a two-year plan and get four additional months free at a huge discount if you go to nordvpn.com goofball. They even have a 30-day money-back guarantee if you don't love the service, which you will. If you connect to a public Wi-Fi source, you have no way of knowing if that Wi-Fi might actually be an insidious interloper trying to maliciously thieve your precious private data. That's why you need a good VPN like Nord when connecting to Wi-Fi in public. Of course, there's always my favorite feature. You can use NordVPN on your TV to access streaming content from other countries all over the world. And as always, Nord will never track, collect, or share your private information. So once again, that's nordvpn.com slash goofball. And remember, bad things just seem to happen to people who don't use NordVPN. Drink a glass of cum, you fascist! Oh hey, I got to read the insult this time! Oh, I guess I'm finally moving up around here! Oh, uh, by the way, uh, What's-Her-Face wanted to invite you to a party or something, but this was like two weeks ago. Oh, how useful. What would I do without you, goofball? You know what? I'm tired of being politically ignorant. I'm a grown-ass man. I have a responsibility to know what's going on in my society. I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna look up fascism in the dictionary! I gotta be honest, goofball. I find this definition to be woefully unhelpful.